Hey there, YouTube viewer. Lord Spoda here. Now, YouTube viewer, it appears that the greatest unsolved murder mystery of all time, the identity of Jack the Ripper, has finally been solved after 126 years. Now you know the story. In the autumn of 1888, a serial killer went on a rampage and killed at least five prostitutes. Six men were considered the most likely suspects, including a hairdresser by the name of Aaron Kosminski. Now, none of the suspects were ever proven to have committed the murders, so this case has remained unsolved for the past 126 years. Well, until now, anyway. Inner businessman and Jack the Ripper aficionado Russell Edward, who bought a shawl at an auction. Now, this shawl was found with the body of one of the Jack the Ripper victims, a Catherine Eddowes. Shockingly, this shawl was stored without being washed. So Mr. Edwards hires a cutting-edge genetic scientist, a Dr. Jerry Luhelinen, to analyze the DNA. Now Dr. Luhelinen, I'm probably pronouncing that wrong, but anyway, Dr. Luhelinen uses a cutting-edge technique that he invented himself to get the DNA off the shawl. It's best described as vacuuming the DNA gently off the material. He compared the blood of Catherine Eddowes to a direct descendant of Catherine, and it turns out it was a perfect match. So we know the blood was the victim's on the shawl. There was also sperm on the shawl. He compared that DNA to a direct descendant of Aaron Kosminski. Perfect match. It turns out that Aaron Kosminski, their hairdresser, was Jack the Ripper. Now what happened to Kosminski? Well, he was a paranoid schizophrenic. He was committed to an insane asylum where he died at the age of 53. So there it is, YouTube viewer. Jack the Ripper finally identified. The killer finally caught 126 years later. Well, what do you think of that, YouTube viewer? Leave a comment below. We'll discuss it. Have some fun with it. And until then, as usual, Lord Spoda out.